Hi everybody, it's Dr. Magnifico from Jerry's Full Vet and Polly.com. This is Cash. Cash is about 10 months old. He's a German Shepherd. Um, he has wonderful parents who got him from the Amish. So he is an Amish puppy. I don't think he's a puppy mill puppy, but he's an Amish puppy. Um, which means that you just have to be really careful about congenital defects. He has an umbilical hernia, so there's his rather large umbilical hernia. The good news is it's closed, meaning if I palpate along the bottom of it, there is not an opening in the inguinal ring that is allowing intestines to come and go, which makes it very dangerous and would have rushed him into surgery long before his 10 months. But he's also cryptorchid, so this is his right testicle. He has no palpable left testicle, so I am removing the one that I can find very easily. This is a prescrotal incision, and then I have to go looking for the other one. We start at the inguinal ring, which is the place that it should have descended out of his body. If I can't find it there under the skin, I have to open up his belly and go looking for it. So this neuter, which would have cost him probably, probably 200 bucks and then maybe another 50 bucks for the inguinal hernia, is gonna cost somewhere between 500 and $800, and it can cost even more than that. Because if I can't find his other testicle, which is normally, very, instead of being this big, normally it's about this big. So kind of the size of a grape or even a blueberry. And it's hard to find a grape or a blueberry in the abdomen when it's not in the place that it's supposed to be. Um, so the cost of this can range anywhere from $500 to $1,000. And sometimes, unfortunately, we even have cases where we go in and we look 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 and we cannot find it. And then we have to do hormone tests an ultrasound and then sometimes we even have to refer them to a surgeon to have them take a look for it um, so be really careful you know you sort of we don't want to say you get what you pay for but sometimes you can get un unknowingly get something that's a bigger problem than you're prepared for um, and the cost can reflect that this is a congenital defect so this dog absolutely needs to be neutered so he doesn't pass it along to his offspring um, but one of the other things I do is I tell people you need to have an exam of your newly of your new puppy within the first three days of getting him so that things like this can be addressed um, we hope that the breeder is going to help pay for this but you know until I see it in someone's bank account I'm never really sure um, so if you have questions about cryptorchids or um, undescended, undescended testicles or even neutering you can find me here at jerrysvillebet or poly.com but the big important thing is go find that testicle don't leave it behind don't let your veterinarian talk you into leaving it behind there's a very good chance that it will cause a cancer and it can be um, life-threatening and I've seen that happen in dogs at you know two or three years old so incur the extra cost go in and get it and then keep Keep looking for it until you find it. And it can be annoying and exhausting and expensive, um, but that's the reality and that's the best way to ensure your pet's health. If you have any questions, you can find me at poly.com. Thanks, take care.